Car ride with Valentina and Luis. Uh, uh, so. Welcome to our lives, people. We are on our way to the gym. It's gonna be hamstrings and ass for Valentina. <laughs> Leg day, hamstrings and glute focus. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm gonna pull a few very interesting tricks out of the. I'm gonna, you know give a lot of pain to those poor hamstrings and glutes. Well, it Valentina, it but it's, it's a little weird because her ass is majestic, all Instagram knows that. Uh, her quads are great, very balanced, but she needs more curve on her hamstring. Uh, I have a very hard time with the muscle-mind connection. Yeah, uh, I've been trying my best to improve that this past year, but it's turned out to be quite difficult for me in particular. Yeah, so uh, one of the tricks I'm going to pull is going to be uh, occlusion training or blood starvation sets. It's very, very interesting yeah. method. Yeah, uh, basically I'm going to clog her leg. So the blood doesn't go anywhere. The pump is insane when you the, do that. No. It's very painful. Uh, it's something you're not supposed to do heavy. Uh, you should be working around 50 to 60 percent of the weight you use. Let's say for 10 reps, you drop the weight uh, to that 50 to 60 percent, and you do the occlusion technique and go at it four five sets around that until well your legs are falling off uh, that technique works for any body part that you can restrict blood on it uh, I'm excited about the leg falling off part mm -hmm. what is uh, this guy doing? What the f are you fucking kidding me? what the heck? back to our peaceful life <laughs> <laughs> it's not a peaceful no. life I think it is very few people in the world is ready for me. I'm not ready for you, and I married you. I tricked you. We arrived! We'll see you soon. <laughs> uh, smiles before the... Before death? Yeah. <laughs> I want to see that smile during the entire workout. That will never happen. Uh, yeah, well... <laughs> Please keep a positive attitude because that is coming. Leg day always warm up. We just finished the first warm-up set. Yes, that was a warm-up. Super challenging. I am not completely burnt out yet, which is a good sign of my strength and my stamina since we started this program, so doing really good. Fuck! 
Come on. Oh, oh. hey, 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 make up. What? Don't, don't pull up. Take it. Oh, get back up. Get back up. I lost my account. Did it fall per leg? No. Oh. Oh. Come on. Wait, One, you were two, talking three, to me, so four, I can't. Five. Get up. Go. One, two, three, four, five. Go. It's a switch. Okay. Six and six. Okay. Just put that go. Six and six. Without stopping. Come on. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, up. Come on. One, two, three, four, five. Up. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, up. Come on, three more. You have that. You have that. Come on. One, two, three, four, five. Up. Two more. Come on. One, two, up, oh, last one, last one with that leg, come on, you got it, one, two, three, fight the pain, come on, fight the pain, up, change your leg, come on, this is the most brutal leg exercise I have found, uh, you can squat 600 pounds, you can do whatever, it's, you know, it's easier to throw weight and you know fight the pain for what one minute is what you last in 10 seconds of you know in 10 reps of heavy squats this is time under tension this is pauses this is control this is a mental war you know and up as you can see she's doing five seconds negative reps one two three four five pausing one two and exploding up that's the most brutal thing you can do, you know, and Make something <laughs> something uh, we always advise, uh, do not increase your weight until you can dominate it, you know, on, when you can do negative tension, when you can do pauses, is when you dominated the weight, then you can increase. Bandit, good morning. Sweat coming out of my head. Bandit, good morning, come on. 20 reps in there. Explosive, just squeeze it, squeeze your butt. Stand in there. There. Okay. So the whole point of this banded good morning is increase the amount of blood on her glutes, increase the tension in the hamstring glute to tie in. Yeah. Go up and squeeze. There you go. Hey, chest up, chest up. Hinge, hinge. No. Uh huh. Back always straight, glutes out, hip in, you know? It doesn't matter if you're going down or up, whatever, your back always flat. Mm. Come on. Up. Up. And a squeeze. I lost count. Give me 10 more. We're gonna do a technique called blood starvation. What that means is we're going to restrict the blood flow right here. It's gonna stay in the hamstrings. What does that do? That helps break more muscle fibers and it's going to help with delivering more nutrients in this portion of the leg, which is the focus right now.
change your life. Go, 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 change your leg. This is painful. Uh, One. Two. Come on. Three. Don't help me so much. Come on. Four. Hold on, let's put it on the top. Four. One. We need ten more. One. Two. Three. Occlusion training. Yeah, pick it that. <laughs> You know, internet friends, what did you look? How was it? It's really hard technique and it's really painful. And because you know, what's the point of making life easier? We're super setting with Jefferson Squad, uh, six reps per stance, you know. Right foot in front, six reps, then left foot in front, six reps. If you're doing Jefferson, change your stance every set. One more. Give us a little review of uh, what you're experiencing. From one to ten, 
How is the pain? I feel like I'm so much stronger, but definitely intense. So you have been it's three, like three weeks into you know real training, back in, back at it, and how do you consider the progression in just three weeks? Amazing. I feel stronger than ever. Like it's really painful everything that you make me do, but I'm just like so much more mentally stronger and physically, and it, I feel so pumped. That's what's up. And I just want to keep you know crushing every workout. Let's go to finish this with glute bridges, ah, uh, uh, <laughs> a hip thruster, whatever. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Just when I thought I was down, no. done. You're gonna do that, supersetting with calves, and you're gonna be done. But you're gonna be doing uh, six sets here and six sets there. For that ass. This is really necessary. This workout was intense. I don't think I can get off the floor right now of how intense that workout was, but I feel super pumped, I feel super motivated, and I'm extremely, extremely proud of myself for what I've achieved in the short amount of time that I've been on this program that Luis has me on. Honestly, I am just dying for the next workout. So I hope that you guys understand that Yes, it's helpful to have people around you that push you. People like Luis, like my husband, who's motivating me and pushing me to my limits. But if you don't have that fire inside of you, then you're never going to achieve what you really want to achieve because you have to have to, you have to, you have to want it. You have to have that fire inside of you. Um, it does help to have an amazing routine, obviously. And the blood restriction technique that we did was super awesome. I really felt everything inside of me and I can't wait to try it again. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys subscribe. And until next time. <laughs>